When ESPN asked LeBron James about Michael Jordan last year, Cleveland's returning king expressed his desire to show respect and pay homage to the greatest. Not every athlete feels the same way about the old guard. A couple days ago, we brought you the first post-victory interview with Gentry Stein, the 18-year-old newly crowned victor of the World Yo-Yo Contest in Prague, whose winning routine is now approaching a million online views. No doubt the guy is super talented and deserves the title, but we were kinda surprised that he dissed Yo-Yo's vets. I ran into this dude and his wife, talking about being Yo-Yo champions in the 70s with Rock the Baby. That's cool they have that story, and so many people have that same story, I was a yo-yo champion in the 60s, and I did walk the dog, but that's what's killing the image. What I'm thinking now is, if we can continue to push this video when it's going viral, and to get as many people as possible to see what it's becoming, we can talk about that instead of how their grandpa was good at something. We called up 78-year-old Bob Rule, aka Mr. Yo-Yo a former champion who appeared on national TV and performed all over the country back in the 1950s and 60s. Many of his vintage yo-yos are housed at the Smithsonian Institution, rules a kindly grandpa, so declined to return Gentry's fire, aside from calling him completely wrong, but schooled us on the sports golden age and why it's taking off again.